Hello everybody, Save to again with a new The Dungeon Beneath run. As last time I will be doing another daily challenge today, this time I have not attempted it before. I will go again for the new game plus one, just to have the enemy stronger and nothing else, because I want to have an easy time to just be, you know, trying out things. Otherwise, uh, if you disagree on that and want to me to try maybe new game plus two, you know, can write it down below in the comments. If you also have the game, you should be realizing right now that these <laughs> videos are getting uploaded one day late. So, I mean, the day after. The reason for that is for me to be more consistent, easier, but I, I could try to maybe do this the same day that the run is uh, launched. But I really don't want to try that, so I guess you will be doing the challenge before me, and then you can, like, see me do the run after. Ariana and Jack, we got that elves do not appear at the campfire. Okay, and we have to attack on 6 HP, and the upside is that start with the pres preset party. Let's see uh, what our preset party is. Wow. Poor soul, what a terrible curse. We are fighting Abaddon again. Well, there's some turning back now. I think this unit normally is like a one attack unit, right? So it having to attack might even be good. Let's see what we got. We got after attack after gaining armor. Okay, plus scheme give plus one power to all allied lizard folk. What? And we get plus one power, plus one armor. What is this? Plus one attack on a mage. He's back only. Let's go. I'm, I'm gonna assume the first fight is gonna be with the one lane enemies. The Watcher targets random cat. Yep, exactly what I was assuming. You stay here to damage the boss. You come over here to damage him. And yeah, let's go like that. Actually, come over here and help with no, no reason to go for help. Let's go. When is the... Yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. Wait, what? <laughs> what a strong enemy! <laughs> I'm telling you, this uh, this this boss really hard here, killing the his own ally. Death. I still want somebody to explain me exactly how this is. Maybe in the last video somebody already explained me, but I asked it in the middle of the video, so this time I'm gonna ask it in the beginning. Can somebody explain me like exactly how these three swords work? Somebody told me there are chances to do the fight again, but every time I lose my hero, I just lose the game. So how exactly do they work? Is it something like when you lose HP and re-roll, then they waste? Or I, I don't understand how exactly these swords work or what they symbolize. Somebody told me the, how many chances you got to win, but I, I don't. So this character gains health upon hero gains plus one power. In south, you're he oh, when he gets handled, then yeah, I got it. So, given armor, this lane plus two armor. I mean, attacks after gaining armor. Come on. That is the combo that the game wants me to go for. So, let's go for it. Although, I will definitely not have a backline, so in the beginning, the team will most likely be something like that. But for now, let's hope for the best. I mean, I have the bird as well. Restoration Ooze, well, an ally does with one health. Okay, as I see, there is no enemy in the bottom, so I can do this setup. Should I destroy every single enemy? Maybe that would be wiser. To destroy every single enemy. Is it though? No, it's not. It's not wiser to destroy every single enemy. What am I talking about? I just want to go through this as fast as possible. 3 damage per round is a pretty good speed. Ah, very nice. Well, let's continue. Uh, they don't pose a threat to me. The middle is damaging me at this point. Ni nice. And we won. He will gain armor and kill him. Ooh, nice. Three. Let's go through the game here real quick. Wow. 
Wow, these are all very good. Let's see what they get. Because he does pretty much nothing right now. <laughs> so, he does gain more armor, right? Yeah. And he does nothing. He just gains health. If, if, he get, if he had gotten attack, it would be so nice. But he gets nothing. I will upgrade the armor smith for the 3 and 4 armor. 4 armor is a pretty high value. So, let's go for the armor smith. The lizard guy is also nice if I go for a full-on lizard team again. Lizard folk. But there are no archers because of the skull. Uh, elves. Oh, there are no elves. Okay, no elves is good. How did I misread that? Let's give this over here. If he drops, we gain some gold. And max HP is also nice. Azile has plus one attack for each skeleton. Yep, there won't be any skeletons. Come over here. Take no hero damage. I won't be taking hero damage. Let's go. This is a free win. Yeah, this is a very, very easy fight. As long as you don't lose any unit with uh, the just one damage the enemy is doing each round. Uh, I'm guessing that at uh, New Game Plus 2 or New Game Plus 3 or 4, it's gonna be harder. I have, fi I have fought this fight with one barrel here and one barrel here. And it's so harder because you cannot destroy this skeleton in the backline fast enough. And the skeleton also have like more help. Let's continue for this. I like my team, so let's go for the gold. Yep, an offer for you. Extra enemy. All the enemies have plus one health, or the boss has just, just give the boss plus three health and let's go on. Yep, good choice. Give a random ally beast plus one attack. It does matter that you have 11 HP. I th think I will get hit here. Yeah, I cannot break this vest fast enough. But I can... I don't think I can do anything fast enough, actually. Yeah. I will take a hit here. I do not see how I can go through this. Maybe I should just go for the strong team on the top. Try to go through this as fast as possible. While these also will try to go through the middle. And I will get a hit or two from the bottom. Hopefully he will give the power to something random. Yeah, I will... I'm, I'm forced to take a hit here. Because even if I do this, the rats will instantly attack before everybody else. So I will take a hit. If I put these both in the middle, then I will take a hit at some point from him. So if I do like something like these, this, I will still take a hit from bottom. If I do this, I will again take a hit for sure because the mice are too fast. So let's just go the route I thought of and let's try this. I will try to break the top while also going through the middle. I will also be I will only be getting hit from the bottom mouse. Nice. He gave the power to a mouse that I don't yeah, he also gets some. Wow. Okay, uh, definitely not going according to plan here. You come here and tank, and let's take. You take a hit. Wait a second. I could. I could give two armor to me every round. Yeah, let's give. Let's give my. Should I start giving myself two armor every round? Yeah, he is going to survive this anyway. Let's take a hit and give give, give, give ourselves armor every round. I think I misplayed this. I think I misplayed this. Uh, let's continue here. Is this attack? This is not power? Okay, I'm still taking no damage. Let's continue. We even got a gold. I'm still thinking if I misplayed this. Okay, I will get hit again, but I will win.
Ah, this was a definite misplay. Uh, yeah. It's okay. In the end, we will get him for two. Let's continue buffing the armor guy. Yeah, I definitely misplayed this. I should just have him at the bottom. And he should be healing me all the time. Like this. And the... No, what? Yeah, I could have spread them out. Simply spread them out. Wow, I played it so bad. Yep, I played it really bad. It's okay. It's okay. Run and gain one power. Let's go. Learning from my mistakes. I could reset it, but... Nah. When, any, uh, when any character dies, gain plus one attack. Okay. I think you two should go together again. Uh, how fast are the skeletons? Definitely faster than me. I cannot protect the bird. The only way I protect the bird is like that, but then I will most likely lose the blacksmith. But I would like to keep the bird alive. Through what lane should I go? He got this, I think. These two got this as well. I think this is a good setup here. He is back lane only, right? Yep. Give me a second. I think I should try to go through the bottom. So he will come over here. He go over here. Yeah, I think I should go like something like that. No, no, that's dangerous. I think I should go something like that. Try to go through the bottom as fast as possible. Yeah, let's uh, let's try this. Okay, you know what? Uh, bird, you gotta protect me here. <laughs> because he's gonna get hit for a bunch and die. Let's go. Okay. Can I win now? 3 plus 1. Is the enemy last or is he before me? The enemy is before me. So you will take the tank hit from him and then 3 plus 2 is a win. And he will never attack. Yeah, let's go. I even take the bonus gold. Yeah, Imag imagine this at uh, plus four. I I'm sure somebody is good enough in this game to do it, but right now, that's not me. Let's continue upgrading hip. Let's go for the shop. Yeah, let's go for the shop. I'm always going for these risky choices. Welcome, sit by. Healing for a mage. Is this a mage? No, oh, he's a hero. Let's get the healing to the mage here. Summon a blood wisp. Gain health. Man no, let's get the healing. Wait, what? What do you have? These are both mage items. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. I like the power gaining. Um, I don't like any of these. Let's uh, let's reroll. Eight speed. No. When not, is this an exhaustible? This is an exhaustible. I can use the note mage only. I can use the plus eight speed on my hero. Yeah, let's just use the plus eight speed on my hero, and the plus armor for to him to no. Yeah, let's let's go for the plus eight on my hero, and let's reroll one more time. I'm then gaining power. I'm gaining gold, health and speed. Wow, that's not that's really nice. Yeah, health and speed is nice. If I could have gotten just attack, let's go for health and speed for him, and let's go. I'm keeping the money. Progression slam. Round end, summon two slams and change lanes. Okay. Let's screw the bottom to get rid of this. 
he will get rid of this in the next round and the team here is gonna just be tanking and attacking I guess but they will also get rid of this let's go go to the top please well is the bird fast enough yeah the bird is fast enough so let's just go on He will f change lanes, so he will definitely not attack me. Yep, very nice. I'm faster than this with 8 attack. The, the 8 speed is very good, in my opinion, on the hero what, that is inexhaustible. Inexhaustible plus speed is a really, really strong combination. This is a win at this point. Even if it comes down. Yep, I knew that he will come down, so you two come over here and exhaust yourselves. And we will get rid of the slimes. This is a pretty much a free round for us. Because he will now get Baryon attack. Nice. Doesn't matter. I can... Yeah, switch the team around again. It doesn't matter. I'm not getting hit. As long as I'm not getting hit, we are good to go. This slime will get removed from the free attack. Nice, this is a free round for us. Actually, you know what? If I do 2 damage to this unit, then he will do 3 damage to the boss. It's better than he do him doing 3 damage. This doing 3 damage to the slime. Yep, come over here. It's a win, right? 1, 2, 3, and we win. Yep, let's go. Actually, 1 and we win. Very nice. Okay, now we will get the healing. Now I just need some power on my hero. And then we are good to go. Twixby. Yep, Armor Smith. Boop, 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 boop. Nice. Now he gives four armor. Get gold. Give me. The first time an ally takes damage, give them shield. Mm. When a non summon ally dies, summon a blood wisp. Mm. When the first time an ally dies, someone an avenging spirit. Uh, maybe the shield. Maybe the shield. First time an ally dies, someone an avenging spirit. Let's go for the avenging spirit. I want to see the avenging spirit. It will also, you know, uh, it will most likely get spawned on the wherever the the bird is. The underneath. Potions. Potions for the traveler. Transform a fighter to a random unit I already have. So it's either gonna become the lizard folk and lose me the run, or become the armor smith and most likely lose me the run. <laughs> so I th Actually, if he becomes an armorsmith, then I can have like one armorsmith in the back and one in the front, and they will each buff each other, and they will pre be pretty much damage immune. I guess. I guess. Allows mages to use equipment for any class. Uh, I don't like this mage, though. I would like to change him if possible. I can get a better mage than him for sure. Yeah, if he transforms into the mage, I will be pretty much dead. And even wasting money to do... Yeah, it's, it's this is too risky. This will lose me run instantly. If, if it fails. Argent Fang, Poisonous, and Round End, Changeling. Okay. This is most of the time the hardest fight of this room. Because I have this uh, all the time, this team here. I think I should try to go through the middle as fast as possible. You tank here. Uh, wait a second. I can destroy this enemy fast enough and he can tank long enough. So... The fastest way to go through to the enemy is the middle. Actually. <laughs> the top, actually. But if I do that, the jack will die right away. So this team will kill him first. And then the vase, and then we'll start damaging the boss. Start 
Does it even make sense? Yeah, I will try this and if it goes horribly wrong, which it will. Whoa, whoa, this is gonna go very wrong actually because two enemies are gonna attack. But yeah, let's, let's go through the middle. And this team will try to drop the top. I don't know if this is a good idea, but I'm gonna try it and if it isn't, I'm gonna just reset. Maybe the swords are how many resets I have? Ooh, it's a 1-2. Can't be targeted. Ooh, it's a 1-2 that always attacks. Okay, got it. Let's, uh, let's go on. Okay, armor smith still, still alive. This unit cannot get attacked. So I will get the hit here. I'll get hit here, right? Yeah. This was not really that smart. Let's reroll. I mean, it. I don't think it will get worse in any case. So let's just reroll here real quick. And let's have him top, him bottom, him top this time so that we have more damage. Let him just be in the middle. To actually, let let get the let's get the armor smith bled first, so we have more time on both of them. And this unit will just go through here, and these will stay here forever. Yeah, I think this is better. I will lose the bird, but it, oh, I didn't even lose the bird. Nice. So because I didn't lose the bird, I can use him later for to tank a damage. He will go down most likely. No, he's attacking before the snake, so he will survive with one. Nice, and this should be a win. Yep, that's how I should have done it. One plus three is three. One plus, I mean two plus one is three. And it's a win. Very nice. Good thing I reset. The reset didn't waste the sword, so I still don't know what these swords do. Come on, very nice. Let's upgrade. I guess him. I guess. I really want to sell. I'm going for a campfire. I will change my whole team here. That's how I see this going down. So let's sell this. There are better units that can benefit from armor gain. I got the archer. So I should upgrade him. Should I transition transition over to a desert fork again? Whenever this character gains power, I do not give power. And an elemental is summoned, gain plus one attack. And an ally dies. I have a bird that dies all the time. Let's pick him up. Now we are going somewhere. Refresh. Definitely not the tanner. Give another ally in this lane plus two power. Just double damage to poison characters. I'm not poisoning anybody. No, let's uh, let's okay change. Human archer. Deal one damage to the lowest health enemy. This is going to destroy me in the final fight. In the fight before the end, actually, this is going to destroy me. Restore one health to a damaged non-heroic ally. Mm. Counter-attack. He won't be surviving to counter. Let's refresh. When an elemental is summoned, game plus one attack. Almost never. Sage of the world. Hope. Give a random ally plus one power. Hope is when I heal, right? I do not have healing. Poison inexhaustible. 5 HP. I can go for the poison inexhaustible. Yeah, let's uh, let's try the poison inexhaustible. Definitely better than the javelier for me. Human only. Wow. Okay. And you stay here. We got a high speed team going in. Let's uh, let, let's try this team and see how this goes. Please call her. Follow up, restore two health to random ally. Okay. Let's try and go through the top, I guess. 
Will the bottom even survive? The mid is going to survive for sure. After he gets the sh after he starts getting shielded, the mid is going to be damage immune. So the mid is pretty much done. The top, the bottom is the most problematic here. Uh, let's go like that and try to defeat the enemies as fast as possible. They have doom. Okay, mid did not survive because I forgot that the enemies have doom. Uh, let's see if I can destroy them fast enough, which I actually should be able... Is my archer? No, my archer is not faster here. Wow, if you don't check attack orders and just randomly play, this game is not that easy. <laughs> He's not going to survive this. Let's reset the battle. I mean, it cannot get, get worse than it just did. Because that was a loss, an incoming loss. Okay, so I lost because the, the bird died. So I have to protect the bird. Can... I th think I should protect the bird like this. These two can just... Are not going to be fast enough, but... I can go fast enough on the bottom and then rotate over to the top. Yeah, let's go. I cannot, I cannot be fast enough on the bottom. That was a lie. And he's definitely not death immune. Okay, you come over here to protect him. Uh, these will survive. Uh, these actually will destroy him, so I will rotate to the top to help destroy them. Uh, the, the armor smith is going to survive for sure, so let's go like that. Nice, 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 nice. Everything is going according to plan. Well, the plan has just failed. <laughs> the moment I lose a unit, the enemies will start doing a, a bunch more damage. He's attacking. Yeah, I have to slow units here. If he was a bit faster, I could like do this and kill him, but I cannot. So I think I gotta lose somebody. And I also need somebody to get buffed by the armor smith. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, I can bring him here so that he destroys him, so that the armor smith gets less damage on him. That bottom line should be able to defeat the boss fast enough. Yeah, let's go. The the, the top line will will be fast enough here. Yeah, yeah, this is a win. Let's go. Let's go. I overthought it. Nice. This went definitely better than the first round. Gold. And let's level up the arch. Let's level up the rogue. What does the rogue gain when he levels up? Does he gain speed? He gains attack. Attack is nice. Yeah, let's go for the rogue. Um, should I sell? I want to transform the plus one health and gold gain on death. That's an item I want to transform and hopefully get something good. The last time she was giving me crazy good items. Have you brought an item? Yes, I have. Gain. Get this. I would like to get the sword. Plus one max health. Not really that much. But not really that good. Let's give this over here. I don't know why I forgot this. Now he has a bunch of speed. Orb Queen. Has plus one attack for each ally. Okay. I think he can tank this. I mean, it's just six. It might be seven if I'm unlucky with the attacks. The mid is gonna go down next round, and whenever, wherever it goes, I will follow it with my unit. So, yeah, let's uh, let's go like that. 
one. Okay. Nice, now he should gain shield. Nice, these will definitely split. There's no way I they do not split. So I will stay in the bottom to do some... No, I will go to the top to help break this gold wisp down. Uh oh. It survived. The wisp survived. Well, um, it's a window, so come over here to the middle to destroy the eyeballs. You know what? I'm pretty sure this fight was easy enough for me to just reroll it. Yeah, this fight was very easy. Let's reset it to get the the wisp. Yeah, come over here. Come over here. Let's get the wisp. Please buff the front line. Thank you. So now we are exactly where we were. With the difference being that he's gonna go down. It's okay. It's okay that the, the um, 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 Guan will go down. Um, yeah, it's okay. Actually, if the Amguan goes down, then I can even win in like two rounds. Let these eyes be here, and then I can avoid the eyes and try to destroy the boss right away. Let's go. Please don't go both bot. Okay. Nice. Top is the perfect place to be. Come over here, help the mid. He is going to survive the two damage. He will actually split it up. So let me be at the Yeah, I'm 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 okay here. Yep. Nice. We won. Much better. Much, much, much better. This was an easy enough fight to not gain the two gold. So I think rerolling was worth it. Come on. Victory. Kill the golden wisp. Five gold. Level up the rogue, and and um, should I risk it? My team's not really that strong, but let's risk it. <laughs> Just to have better chances on the final fight. An offer for you. Then me here has plus three health. So if it's the Jin, this is the choice to go. Otherwise, this is the choice to go. I'm hoping it's the gin, so let's go for this. I might lose just because I pick it, but you never know. It's not the gin. We might lose here. Pack leader targets the lowest health enemy. 17 HP. Okay, so he will damage the... the oh, it's 50-50 on what he will damage. I think I should keep the middle as is. And try to help... Let's try the bottom. Actually, the bottom should be able to defeat this fast enough. Who is attacking and in what order? Okay, so the, the, the pack leader is going to attack the Amguan. Because he the Amguan is going to have the least HP. After him and him destroy the, the bird and the other thing. So I should go to the bottom and try to break uh, protect the Amguan as fast as possible. I need the bottom lane to be done. Okay. What happened? Who did he attack? He attacked the rogue. Okay. Can I even protect the rogue? I don't think I can. Actually, the rogue should survive. 
Yeah, the, the rogue should survive. Uh oh. Ah, the archer. It's okay. Well, the rogue survived, so I don't care. Um, yeah, we won. Let's go. The rogue is pretty much damage immune at this point. And he will attack. Yep, exactly. This is a win. Let's go. And I can even level him up now. Now he will have three attack. Very nice. Very nice. Defeat the enemy hero. Level and hop. Plus 2 HP and plus 1 damage. One of the best upgrades. It would be really nice if every single upgrade gave attack or at least something offensive like more healing. Because some upgrades really, really feel bad. Like this one. This one just gaining 2 HP. Why why would every anybody upgrade something for just 2 HP if the rogue has the exact same upgrade for 2 HP plus the damage? Health the rogue. Let's go. Some some choices seem weird. Clypean simulate gain shield counter gain shield. Okay, if he has counter gain shield, I sh I think I should go through the whole enemy team as fast as possible. Definitely the bottom line here because yeah, he is not going to survive two hits. That's a given. Maybe even swap these around. Because he is going to survive three hits. At least. And the top lane will do more damage here quicker. So they might be able to destroy the simulator fast enough. The middle is damage immune. For sure. The middle is 100% damage immune. So let's go. After the first round, the rogue will never get hit again. Okay, so yeah, he can survive one more round. These two together will do four to him, and then he will need three more hits. I'm thinking about trans transferring. Actually, you know what? I was thinking about doing this because no, it doesn't work. Maybe this. I was thinking about these two to destroy... Ah, they won't even destroy him. Yeah, cancel that. Uh, let's continue here for one round. And I will see what I will do in the next one. Because I don't want the enemies to be attacking, right? At all. Every time I kill the enemy before... Before it attacks, it straight up doesn't attack. So now I can do this. And he is not going to attack. I can also do this because... Yep, nobody's going to attack if I play it like that. You don't attack. Yep, you didn't attack. He will attack, but it's okay. Yep, thanks for the shielding. So, again, he will not attack. He will not attack because the archer is faster. And... You know what? You come over here, you come over here. So now the same thing applies, with the difference is that the rogue will get the armor. And we won. Inexhaustible is also a very strong ability. <laughs> In case it wasn't apparent. Because I can move around and attack at the same time. That's also why high attack is nice. I like the rogue. Being inexhaustible and also getting an attack on... Attack on the level up. The thing I actually don't like about this game uh, is... I will give it to him because I know he gains damage on the level up. The I thing I don't like are these uh, random... Egg, uh, this this one in particular, the, the holes or the spider webs. Things that pretty much break some, some builds completely. Uh, I should get more units. I, I want to get rid of the Amungam, Amungumam. This is the last chance to buy units. We are at the Abyss, right? Yeah, we are. At, are we at the Abyss? Where can I see what room I am at? You know what? I will go with time played. So uh, I'm at the 40 minute mark. So I'm pretty sure this should be the... Wait. Is this the abyss? 
Yeah, I think this is the abyss. I, I, how did I get lost? Where can I check if this is the abyss or not? Actually, this is not the abyss. Let's go on. Because I haven't fought a single salamander, whatever, dragon fights that are in the abyss. <laughs> Hello again. Take a look. More things. The seven health fighter armor. Yeah. I'm pretty. Deal one damage to all poisoned enemies. Ooh. Gnome only. Is he a gnome? Ooh. This is follow up as well. So this will pretty much give him plus one damage. Straight up plus one damage. And this plus one damage to the archer as well and speed. So yeah, let's uh, let's get this for sure. And should I give him the bunch of armor? Two instead of two health. Do we have another fighter? Seven health. I think attack is more important. Yeah, attack and speed is more important, especially in the final fight with Abaddon. I can sell some things here, maybe. I can sell. I need to sell three things. I cannot really sell three things. Yeah, I cannot really sell three things. Well, it's okay. Let's go on. I know that the bunch of HP is really important, but... An allied beast dies. Gain plus one attack. Round and change lanes. Okay. So normally I should definitely not destroy the Lycan Alpha. If, if I don't destroy the Lycan Alpha, we should be good to go. So... How can I not... Is he changing lanes as well? Yeah, he's changing lanes as well. I should definitely not destroy the Lycan Alpha here. Let's try to go through the top and the bottom as fast as possible. But he needs to give armor to somebody. He can give up. Nah. How can I play this? How can I play this? Maybe bring the bird in the middle? That does make sense. He will get it for 3. It, 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 3 damage is okay, even if it gives the armor to nobody. Otherwise, I could do something like this. Or something like this. And be here, so that he gives me the armor. Ah, that's, that's uh, really bad. I think this is the way to go. They will gain Doom plus one power, but it won't matter because I am attacking faster. So I will have the bottom, they will go through the top. There's no reason for me to help the bottom, actually. Yeah, let me help the top so we go through them faster. This is right away seven damage, and then I will come to the bottom and help him. Yeah, let's go. I will help in the next round. Okay. Both top. Wow, that's really bad. Mm, he will survive this. You come over here. Help out. No, he, he isn't even surviving this. I don't even know. need to go over there. Let's uh, transition him over. He will get more damage to the Aqualis, and I will stay here to do more damage. Actually, no, yeah, like that, it's better. Let's go. Okay. I think I should stay as I am. No, I should definitely not. You two come over here. I come over to the top. You one-shot this guy. Uh, so he will not attack at all. And he will summon three like Three, wow. Three is a really high number. Let's go still. This is a better setup. Maybe I should... Yeah, maybe I should... Nah. That might have been a mistake. I still got this though. He has 7 attack. Will he survive? Yeah, he will survive and one-shot this Lagom Throw. And then he will go down. I should help there in the middle. Yeah, he will get it for 2. Then do 7 back to him. 
And then he will destroy him in one shot. It's okay. I will help her at the bottom to remove this target because Agbalis is gonna gain a bunch of attack the next... Uh, that doesn't even make sense. Let's let's help here in the middle to remove him and then the next round I will go down to remove him as well. And yeah, everything's gonna get removed and I will only have the boss to fight. Which should be pretty easy. Yep, you're toast. You have just one HP. I calculated this happening. Okay, now I will go back. I will lose the rogue with... Okay, I will lose the rogue because I got buffed. That was the one mistake I did. Yeah, actually he would have. I would have lost him anyway. So let's go on. I think this is a win. Destroy him. Poison him. Damage him. 3, 1. Rogue will go down. Now just don't go to the top. Ah, yes, of course. <laughs> just don't do one thing. Anyway, I'm still winning. Let's go. Let's go. Very nice. We are already at the 50 minute mark. Today I'm really slow. Let's uh, Archer again. Level him up to do 4 damage. This gives him plus 1 damage, right? Perfect. Now he does 4 damage with a bunch of speed. So we got the damage run going. When an ally gets armor, they gain plus 1. Okay. The first time an ally takes damage, give them a shield. At this point, this is also nice. Give a random allied human plus 1 power. Run. Round end. Mm. I don't know. I want to sell out the uh, the mage that I got. I want to change the mage, and I do have a human. The human is the the armor smith. So the armor smith plus one attack, plus one armor every time the armor smith buffs somebody. I think the plus one armor is is actually viable. First time an ally takes damage. This is also viable. An ally human plus one power every round. This is just plus one attack and armor. Let's uh, let's go for the armor. Let's go for the more armor. I want to s find something to change the Aguila. But what would I change? Another mage is the only thing I could change to. The Abyss. Let's go exchange an item. Uh, no, that's not what he does. So an item, archer, uh, random archer item for 5. Allow mages to use equipment from any class. I don't want the Amguan to get leveled up. I don't care about the Amguan. Um, let's just get the random archer item. Tans ring. What does it do? Anti-poison? Team 4 armor at the start of the round. Meh, it's okay. It's not really that good. It's not really that bad. Target's highest health, enemy poisonous. Highest health is going to be the rogue, exactly. Let's set up here the defensive thing. Do tank. Uh, I should try to destroy the enemy as fast as possible. No, what am I doing? You go help here at the top. Doesn't really matter what I choose to do with my unit. Let's help the top out. I definitely don't want to go mid because I want the rogue to get buffed every single round. And I, he, uh, the, the scorpion is going to attack the rogue no matter what. Okay. So now the rogue is pretty much damage immune. He still is the highest health target. Oh no. Oh no, the armor smith is. Well. Let's go through the top with this group. No, I want to damage the boss as fast as possible, as much as possible. I, I will try to defeat the boss quickly. Okay. Nice. They left the opening up open. Yep. Now he will attack the back line. Let's continue here. Rogue, Rogue is poisoning everybody. Okay, nice. The middle opening here is also very nice for us. I don't need to change anything. Is he fast enough? He is not fast enough. He will go down, which will give more power to the archer for the next... I'm, I'm winning. I'm, I don't need to calculate anything. Yep, I won. That's why high speed is nice. Within exhaustible units. High speed within exhaustible units is really nice. 
victory. Let's go on. Come on. Uh, I cannot level him up. I didn't even want to level him up. Let's get a mage. That's better than the one we have. So normally we have a, a 2 4 mage. Why is, is he a 2? Why does he have to attack? Do I give him something? I don't know why his attack is buffed right now. Did I give him something? What what mage is this normally? Normally it is this one, right? No, normally it is this one. He has one. Why? I don't know why he has plus two attack. Seems like I have done something. Is it this one? First time I summon spirit. Give plus one to allied. I don't know why he has a permanent plus one attack. I seem to be missing something. Yeah, well, whatever. Let's see what choices we get. This girl gives us an enemy. The attack. Wow! Plus three. He has three attack and he's gonna chain attack. It's really nice. Human archer, deal one damage to the lowest health enemy. No, definitely not. This is very dangerous in the fight before the fight before the boss. Death, give all allies shield. No. I would pick the Praliator here. If um I I have two good mage items, so for now I'm re-rolling. I just want a mage. Let's let's have him keep these. I'm guessing he just has the power from the last round. Yeah. Still one health for each lizard folk. If he's jumping around. Edric, Fence Master. Attacks twice and is inexhaustible. I really like this. Give all characters in this column plus one armor. I really like this as well. I actually like both of these. He has 7 speed and is inexhaustible. If I give him a bunch of attack... I don't know how I will give him a bunch of attack, but... If I somehow give him a bunch of attack... I like this. And I also like this. I also have the plus one armor. Yeah, let's go for the armor. Let's go heavy armor. Hang. Uh, it's okay that we lose. Uh, does he do two damage at least? Yeah, he does do damage at least. I think the, da the armor he will give the party is gonna outscale whatever... Uh, the just plus one attack on mage. Yeah, I, I, I lose the items. The items are really good. Okay, I realize that. But... It's okay. It is okay. That's what my idea, what's my plan, and that's what I'm gonna go for. This is round end. I could even sell the armor smith <laughs> and place the fencing master in, and everybody will gain two. Or... Nah, let's keep the armor smith. <laughs> let's keep the armor smith in. Should I though? Should I go for the plus two armor every round? I could go for the plus two armor every single round. Yeah, let's uh, let's do heavy risking. Time to do some heavy risking. If we lose, we lose. I want to try this. Menacing Radiance. Summon Twin Stable Radiances. Can he be in the back line? Wow, he can even be in the back line. Nice. For now, he is going to be in the front line, though. Uh, let's go. Oh, no. I should have... Yeah, that was a mistake. I should have had the Archer in the middle. Uh, it actually that was not a mistake. There will be pretty much no difference. The thing that will make a difference though is the royal cap not being in the middle. So these two can destroy. Actually, yeah, let's go for here. These two can destroy the unstable radiance fast enough, and these two can definitely destroy this ra unstable radiance fast enough. Three, and he will do two, and then two to the next. So very nice. Yep, I need to swap these things around. And I know now is not the chance to do it. The chance is going to be when there are going to be two unstable radians on the top. So again, these two will destroy the radians fast enough. And yeah, let's go for the damage. Come on. Okay, can I get the double radians in the middle? 
Okay, I think now is the chance to... No, still not the chance to switch around. Let's go on. I, I don't even need to switch around anything. He's just losing 1 HP per round. Now is definitely not the chance to switch around. Uh, they will take a hit for 5, but I'm winning next round, I think. Yep, I'm definitely winning next round. So, let's avoid this. Let's just win. Nice. I like my team a lot more. I like it a lot more. Because even the guard having a, if he, even if the guard gets exhausted, he still activates his ability. At round end. Should I sell? Uh, I think, yeah, I will go for the trade. Because I want to trade off. Did I have the choice to heal and I sold it? <laughs> I just realized. Let's, uh, let's give this uh, plus 4 HP and make it a sword. I think it always becomes a sword. Yeah, nice. Very nice. 4 attack is more important than just 4 more health. Which I can pretty much not heal. Change lanes, gain plus 1 attack. So now, you know what's gonna happen? You are gonna follow this dragon around. While the rogue will always try to be... Uh, whatever this is corrupted, I guess not. Let's do that. I was thinking about giving the mushroom thing. Oh, it's a no, 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 it's a no only. Forget it. Didn't think about anything. <laughs> Forget whatever I was thinking. Let's uh, let's go. I don't really think it matters where the rest of the team is. This will be over quick. I have so much damage here. Yeah, this will be done in like two rounds. Um. The rogue will tank this, in my opinion, so that's gone. It's just 8 damage. Nice. Okay, this though, nobody can... This is 10 damage, so he can tank this. Let's go. Nice. Okay, uh, he will survive the 6 damage hit, so let's continue. Yeah, I was thinking about putting the mushroom on him, but the mushroom is a gnome only item, so I can't do that. And let's attack and win. Nice. I didn't want to go to a lizard folk run, but... Uh, and it pretty much worked out for me. I didn't want to... So, I didn't get the Lizard Folk run going. I'm pretty happy for that. Let's go for... nobody. Let's... Uh, I will not definitely not buy a new unit, so let's just go over here. Uh, the Djinn is in this room, so... <laughs> I don't know why I was thinking about fighting the Djinn. An offer for you. Gimme. Enemy hero will have plus 10 health. It's going to be the Djinn. I believe in the Djinn. Come on, it's going to be the Djinn. And not the dragon. Please, not the dragon. Thank you, game. <laughs> I'm bird spirit. This was free. <laughs> so... I will have the tank in the middle and the high damage people... No, the high damage people should be in the middle. Wait a second, do I do 15 damage per round? Because if I do, I can like tank this forever. He's very slow if I remember correctly. Yeah, so I will do 4 and 4 is 8. And 3 and 4 is 7. 8 and 7 is 15. Yeah, I'm pretty much damage immune. Let's go. Let's go. The enemy cannot damage me at all. This will take some time. But oh, whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. I just realized it's not a good idea to let this take a lot of time. Now we got this. <laughs> Yeah, the gene is even losing HP, so... Yep, the bird does not make any difference here. Uh, you know what? Forget the vase. The gene's gonna go down faster than the vase is. Yeah, for sure the gene's going down faster than the vase. <laughs> Look at this crazy team we got going. We are doing more than 15 damage per round. 
I think it's a pretty high number. Yeah, we are doing um, 18 damage per round. This obviously doesn't count. Ember Spirit. I don't know why I called the Jin. Because of the vase. Because it dies when the vase breaks. And we won. Yeah, you can move all around all you want. Nice. Is there achievement? To destroy the Ember Spirit instead of the <laughs> vase? Yeah, plus the armor. Very nice. Let's go for the item. Give me something for a fighter. Plus one attack, minus two health. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this is a really bad idea, though. I... He's an exo... Can I kill him? Bugs. Bugs all around. <laughs> so, should I... This is plus two attack. This is very good. He's inexhaustible. I can move him around. Let's go like that. If I find something that gives him even one more attack, four is the gold number here. Abyss Guardian. Summon an Infernal Wisp. Yeah, exactly. Look at this. This worked out. This worked out. I should give this plus four armor. Yeah, I don't know why I have the Titan's Ring on him. I should give this to somebody else. I think it's not an Archer exclusive item anyway. So... I should try to get... Give me a second here. These... Ah, these give only the Abyss Guardian plus one health. Okay, then I'm staying like that. And... Yeah, I'm staying like that. Try to get rid of everything here. Let's uh, start attacking the Abyss Guardian actually. Uh, these two are gonna go do three and one, four and one from the poison, two from the poison, six. This is dead. So let's go through the middle here with this team. And this team is gonna go through the top. Everything's gonna get destroyed very quickly here. Okay. Let's buff the team up. Nice. And again, everything's gonna get destroyed really quickly. Yeah, nothing is surviving here. The... Exactly. He will attack and then die. Okay. And... Uh oh, I didn't saw that. I didn't saw that. I did not see that. And... Yeah, this I am seeing, but this I will take because it's just 5 damage. He is not gonna survive this. Yeah, he's not gonna survive this. Can I win on the next round? It doesn't matter if he's not gonna survive this. I will chuck the bird over there and suicide it. I want to... Yeah, let's go. If, 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 if it goes really bad, I can just reset. What I would like now to happen is for a... For a spirit to summon in the middle. Uh, in the bottom, in the bottom. A, a spirit in the bottom, please. Ooh. Pop is bad. You sacrifice yourself for the greater good. And we fire another free round. We still, we won. At the top. Come on, at the top, at the top, come on. Bottom is also good. I want to get the more money, so you suicide yourself over here. These two should be able to destroy him fast enough. Yeah, let's go. One, two, and win. Nice. We did it. The poison thing that we got is really good. Nice. Gold. We got the team going anyway. Let's go for the shop. Come on, give me something good. Also... Yeah, or Traveler, whether for some occasion. You know what? You give this over here. Give this over there. Plus two attack, minus three speed. Five speed is okay, though. Five speed is okay. Plus one health. No. How much speed? Seven. Two speed. This is also very nice. He has seven. He's okay. I think I will give these two. What is this? Three health? Well, start the comp. No. <laughs> I will give these two to the archer. So that he loses speed but regains 
uh, keep the speed. Five is um, five is good, but I think I want to go for seven just to be sure that I'm the fastest one in the in the four fight. Let's refresh. Let's go because an enemy deal one damage to a random enemy. Ooh, another deal of poison. Yeah, really nice here. Let's uh, send the two max HP. I want to keep him sped up. Yeah, let's send the two max HP over. And let's keep doing even more poison damage. Two health and two speed. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Eight speed. Two health and two speed is nice, though. I will give 2 health and 2 speed to the royal captain. And I will keep my money for the next shot. I know what the next fight is. It's the hand of Abaddon. Hand of Abaddon. Targets only and just enemy. Yeah. He, he attacks randomly. So I guess good luck for us. You come over here. Uh, you, yeah, you go through the bottom. You stay in the middle just because I don't want you to be attacking this unit twice. You can attack that unit once every return. It doesn't really matter. And the rest of the team is gonna go through the top. Everybody go through the middle as fast as possible. So, yeah, let's go. Okay, the guard got hit. Nice. Now we start the armoring up. Maybe I should. Yeah, you know what? Let's uh, let's poison this guy. Okay, still surviving. Still surviving. Okay, switch this around again. Because he does more DPS. I just wanted to poison the boss real quick. Okay, please go for the middle or the bottom. No! That was really, really, really bad. Well. Well, let's sacrifice the... Oh, that was really bad. Let's sacrifice the bird. And I think I even should... Ah, uh, I don't know if I will be fast enough now. Okay. I think I will not be fast enough. Yeah, I don't see a surviving here. Let's first... Uh, let's take some damage. Let's take some damage. Okay. Ghost, stop doing that. I think I can win in time. Now, first of all, I'm not losing right now. So if I defeat him now, 2 HP is okay. Nice, nice, nice. 2 HP loss is okay. It's fair enough. I like that we have high FDP. Nice, we got even the healing. I don't care about that one gold. Allied summon units gain plus one attack. Nice. Allied fighters. Wow. We could not have gotten a better thing. We could not have gotten a better thing. Now we have the four attack on the double attack guy. Yeah, this is a win. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever. Uh, when this character kills an enemy, restore two health. Might as well, I guess. Nah. What will I throw away? Plus two speed is nice. Plus one attack on the archer instead of the speed would be the choice. I think not. I think not. The only unit we care about giving something is him. So maybe let's give him the armor. The armor per round. Or should I give the armor per round to this unit? Yeah, let's give the armor per round to him. So let's give the permanent... No. Let's give the armor per round to the tank because he's gonna stay in the middle in the fight with Abaddon. And let's reroll to see if we get something with my 7 gold here. Plus 1 attack, plus 2 speed instead of just plus 2 speed. I think is the choice. No. 3 health on the fighter. 
could also be good. But I think I will go for the plus one attack on the ranger. Let's, this is just plus two speed, right? Let's give the plus two speed to anybody here. And let's give this plus one attack. And I, I have to sell something. You know what? Uh, Abaddon in the first round does nothing. So this will do nothing as well. Let's sell it. Let's give this over here. And let's go. Good thing I know what the uh, champion does. What the monster, the boss does. Yep. Transform each turn. And first turn, do nothing. Like, right? Yep. First turn, do nothing. You tank here. Uh, I'm having him in the middle because for the 8 damage attack. Otherwise, I think the plan is to be as fast as possible. Let's go. Let's see how much damage we do per turn. Okay, we do about 30. So we should be winning in 10 rounds. Summon a Poison Sphere. Uh, yeah, I don't care. Let's go. I mean, I do care. It's really dangerous, but you know what I mean. Yeah, I'm doing more than 30. <laughs> okay, this poisons the lowest health enemy. So this is going to poison the bird. Perfect. He does the 8 damage attack. So... I cannot really avoid killing the poison sphere. <laughs> it's, 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 it's not possible. So, let's go. It is possible if I do some swaps. But then something else is going to get hit for 8. Which I definitely don't want to be happening. And the bird's gonna become a spirit, so who cares? The only thing I don't want him to do is the summon three. Perfect, that's one of the good ones. The only thing I don't want him to do is the summon... No, the... Do max damage to a unit, the, the most HP unit. That would be the worst. Oh, both middle. That's really bad. Can't recover health, can't gain armor. Well, the can't gain armor is gonna get killed anyway. So, Paralyzing Attack. Is there a reason for me to try to help in the middle? I don't think there is. What's the attack order here? Yeah, he's gonna do 3 and then he's gonna do... Yeah, I, we can... Yeah, my damage will get wasted. Let's uh, attack here. Nice, nice. Wow, this might be the fastest Sabaton fight I ever had. What do you do? Summon a Poison Sphere, so he does nothing. I will not help on this. Yeah, I will not help on that. Let's... Uh, yeah, let's go on. I will help on it in the next round. This round, I will help on it. So this is gonna poison my Archer. And he's gonna do 8 to the middle. Yeah, it's okay. 1, 2, this will go down. The archer will do 7. Let's go. The archer won't be going down fast enough. I think we can beat this in 4 rounds. What do you do? Summon 4 golden spheres. Uh, so, free damage is what you mean. <laughs> you are gonna do free damage. Next. Well. Easy. Wait, is it? No, I need the middle to... Sh uh, the middle can tank this. The bottom cannot. So I will help the bottom out. Wait a minute. Yeah, he can destroy them alone. Very nice. And I can help the mid out as well. So let's do, go like that. Paralyzing attack. It's okay. Um, not Nobody will get damaged here. I will destroy all the spheres. One. You will do seven. Nice. And you will do both. Very nice. Okay. Well. What are you doing? Confusing ray. Okay then. So we just continue. Okay. Okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. What are you gonna do? So, nothing. He does nothing. Perfect. So I will have time to set up my team again. I'm losing the archer the next round. Actually, I'm not. <laughs> because he, he threw the royal captain into the back line. <laughs> Very nice. Set the highest health unit to 1 HP. 
Okay, you come over here and you come over here again and let's go. The lowest unit is him. So... Should I even protect him? Should I protect the archer? Nah, who cares? This is over. You come over to the top. Do Wait a minute. I'm attacking faster than the archer, yeah, so I will help the archer here go through this. The archer will survive because poison applies first to the armor. What is this? Summon four golden spheres. I think I won. Yep, the archer will go down, but I won. Prepare for a very high pitched explosion sound. Now. Okay, seems like it didn't happen. Well, the moment the rogue attacks, we win. So prepare for the explosion. Because of the poison uh, ability. The portal remains open. New game plus complete. I know. <laughs> I really like this team. I really like this team. The soul fighter. Boss defeated, unspent gold, zero. <laughs> Check if completed wild rooms. Okay, continue. Ixotl, the hatchling board. Death, fill your board with lizard for hatchlings. Okay. So, yeah. That was it. I really liked the run. <laughs> I really liked the run. It was a fun one. Having fighters was fun. So yeah, there you have it. Uh, Shoutouts to Barbolox for being the topest of the topest Patreon. If you'd also like to support me, there will be links in the description. Otherwise, come join the Discord to, you know, be able to discuss with me anything you would like. Because that's the easiest way to speak with me. If you liked the video, uh, drop a like to keep the series alive. Otherwise, I mean, I, I have to switch series every now and then. Uh, also, comment if uh, you would like me to go for higher uh, higher difficulty levels. I actually like it at uh, New Game Plus 1, but um, yeah, maybe it's too boring. Although, it, it's... Anyway, I, I like having... Being easier to play the game instead of, you know, calculating every single move just to win. And I will go... I was thinking about going for higher difficulties when I will try to min-max it as well. Because right now, I'm also trying different teams, like this fighter team. If it was a new game plus four, I might have lost uh, because I didn't play the best team possible. So yeah, that's also a reason I'm going for a new game plus. So anyway, <laughs> I digress. I think uh, that was it for today. So yeah, thanks for watching and see you guys around.